Selection highlighting in Silo lets you move your hover your mouse over different parts of the model and then see what you would select before you actually select it. So if I actually click and then drag and then I start to select and so um, it just lets me work with this much easier. And so you can see, let me subdivide this model. Uh, this will work in all the different selection modes. So here's edge selection mode where I can select edges. Um, here's vertex selection mode, select vertices. And then in multi-select mode, I can highlight over edges, vertices, or faces, and whichever I start selecting, then it will go into that selection mode. So if I click off and then uh, say I highlight a vertex, then it will go into vertex, vertex selection mode. So it's a nice quick way to uh, get between editing um, vertices, edges, and faces. One of the real nice things, let me go back into face selection mode here, um, is that this works not just when you're hovering directly over the model, but also when you're off the model. It will look for the nearest component, and this is mirroring my selection because I've got uh, symmetry mode enabled here. But as I'm hovering over here over in profile mode, you can see I don't have to hover exactly over these uh, little uh, face areas right here. I can um, hover off to the side and it will detect that. So if I combine that with tweak selection, this uh, allows me to work in profile and I can see it in profile while I'm doing these tweaks. And so that can um, let me do some real sort of clay-like manipulations that make modeling really fast and intuitive.